ever pondered over the complexities of obtaining a work visa for Saudi Arabia from Pakistan? It may seem like a daunting task, but with a proper understanding and the right approach, it's not as complicated as it seems. First things first, the process begins with securing a job offer from a Saudi Arabian employer. The employer plays a vital role in this journey, as they will act as your sponsor and start the visa process on their end by applying for a visa authorization through the Ministry of Labor in Saudi Arabia. Another method to secure a Saudi work visa is through recruitment agencies in Pakistan. These agencies have established networks with Saudi Arabian employers and can assist you in securing job offers. Once the job offer is in place, they also provide guidance and support in the visa process and document preparation. However, it's crucial to choose a reputable agency. Some agencies may promise faster results but could lead to complications or fraud. Using a recruitment agency can simplify the process, but make sure to choose a reputable one to avoid any complications. Once the visa authorization is approved, your employer will send you the visa authorization number. This number pivotal for the subsequent step, which is filling out the online application form on NJAS, the official visa services platform of the Saudi government. This is the third scene in our process. Carefully cross-verify your information before submitting it, as any inconsistencies can lead to setbacks or even a refusal of your application. In our fourth scene, you'll need to gather and prepare the crucial documents. This encompasses your passport, which must be valid for a minimum of six months, photos, a medical report, a police clearance certificate, and an academic or professional qualification certificate. The medical report must come from a medical center that is recognized by the Saudi Arabian Embassy, and it should explicitly state that you are free from all contagious diseases. The police clearance certificate is to show that you hold no criminal records. Once all your documents are assembled, it's time to present them to the Royal Embassy of Saudi Arabia in Islamabad, either personally or through an approved agent. Alongside your documents, you'll also be required to pay the visa fee, which fluctuates based on the nature of the job and duration of stay. It usually takes around one to two weeks for the embassy to process your application. If everything goes smoothly, they will stamp your passport with a work visa, and you will be ready to kickstart your new journey in Saudi Arabia. Wrapping up, procedure of obtaining a work visa for Saudi Arabia from Pakistan involves securing a job offer, scene one, applying for a visa authorization, scene two, completing the online application form on NJAS, scene three, preparing and submitting the necessary documents, scene four, and paying the visa fee, scene five. It may appear like a lot, but remember, each step brings you nearer to your target. So, remain patient, stay focused, and before you know it, you'll be on your way to commencing a new chapter in Saudi Arabia.